So now we're going to talk about how to make a slope shade. So as we discussed last time how to make the hill shades, we saw that if we want to see from different angles, then we want to make hill shades looking from different directions. In contrast, with a slope shade, we can essentially see regions with high slopes in different directions. So to make a uh, slope shade, we again want to go to raster data analysis, and this time we're going to go to slope. So we're going to look at some of these parameters here. The input layer, we want to be the digital terrain model or DTM. Last time we did not change this uh, ratio of vertical units to horizontal, and again we don't need to change that. This check here says slope expressed as percent instead of degrees, so I'd like to calculate this as degrees, so let's leave this unchecked. Degrees will get value and slope that ranges from 0 to 90. And again, we want to save this as a permanent fire file, not as a temporary file. So we'll go to save to file, um, and then we can say slope. Save, and then here we can see this gdoc command. So this will run gdaldem slope to make the slope map. Click run, and wait a few seconds. So here is our slope map, and um, we may want to change the symbology, for example, to go from white to black, and see here that the slope values range from 0 to 66. Sometimes you may want to change these values, um, but see what they look like. Apply. Okay, so here is our slope map. You can see that areas with high slope are black, areas with lower slope are white, and you can see that this uh, slope map does highlight um, features that have these north-south orientation as well as this east-west orientation.